Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received more than you will ever know. So, what I need you to do right now, Pisces, is I need for you to give me all that fun-loving, exuberant, beautiful energy that you get. You can do that by clicking that like button. You can comment. You can share. You can subscribe. You can do all those wonderful, magical things that you do to me so well here at Tiny's Tarot. So, I'm going to put down the holy water. I've got the hiccups a little bit. Strange, but whatever. <laughs> Woo, okay. So, Pisces, you know what time it is. Tarot is now in session. The most honorable judge, T. T. Dong, presiding. You may all keep eating your sandwich. <laughs> so, we're going to check in on the energy of the person you're dealing with or whatever energy is going to be coming towards you, my beautiful loves, whatever the case is. We're going to get it, hit it, and then we're going to quit that shit together. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, dog. Show. Yes, and these cards are shuffled a bazillion trillion times. The two to the three of swords. Oh my god. Let me just get out my sword already. <laughs> my sword's still bigger. Thank god. <laughs> Show! Is that another? Nope, it's not another sword. Okay. All right. Let me get my protection stones out here. Because I gotta have protection for everything. Because good heaven lord knows. But ugh, never mind. I'm not gonna even. Not going there. Two of cups. Or two of cups. Two of swords. Three of swords. The emperor. The lover's card here. Okay. So. Uh, Pisces. Oh yeah 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 yeah. Cupid here is like. Drawing back his bow, and then he's like, I don't know. I'm going to see where this uh, this divine masculine is going to take this here. Okay? So, mm-mm-mm-mm-mm, Pisces. Something's, this is, this is, this is, this is, I don't know. This person's want love, but they're also very passionate. Let's just say that. They like passion. Let's just say that. So Cupid, the universe, uh, is like, mm, I don't know. I don't know. We're going to see how far this person is going to push Pisces. If this person's going to be legitimate here and own up to love here. And uh, if this person doesn't open up to love here. And uh, I feel like the universe is going to eject this person. Push an eject button and this person's going to shoot right out of the plane. <laughs> they're gonna they're gonna eject this person out of your life if this person doesn't show up to you right two of swords so the situation is at an impasse at a deadlock your person um you guys could not be talking right now at this time uh three of swords this person here um their psyche has been affected by this quite heavily okay so this person is in a great deal of psychological pain right now over the situation we got the emperor down here on the table divine masculine energy here the son of god s-u-n not s-o-n um so oh boy pisces uh the emperor he is you know he doesn't approach people people approach him and they talk to him okay and so this person is used to people approaching them Okay, they don't approach people, but people approach them. So we're going to have to talk. We're going to have to get into this, right? <laughs> oh, my star. Okay. Okay. Well, let's just work it left to right because this is what's coming out here. Let's go two of swords here. Why is this two of swords here? What's this person, what's this person trying to figure out here? Oh, boy. Jesus. 
<laughs> That's a Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands is a card of taking the high road here. Um, because it's like, you know, uh, you're trying to honor your highest principles. When So basically, your person is being faced with some kind of mental opposition here. And this person is trying to take the high road and stand and honor this person's own um, principles, honor their own values here, especially when it comes to love, okay? This is what's coming through. It is the Page of Cups crossing the Seven of Wands. So oh, what's going on here with the Seven of Wands? What's, what's going on here? Mm, it's the star. Let me get out my protection stones again. Yeah, that's just kind of like a repeating message right there with the star coming out with that. So, yeah, I feel like this person is trying to, right now, it's just like they're really trying to honor themselves and to heal themselves right now. I don't know why, but this is what's coming off this energy here for whatever reason. So they're standing firm on their ground here. And there's a sense of renewal here also with the star. So what's this renewal with the star? Let's go. Renewal with the star. Top to bottom, what's this renewal with the star, please? What's the, yep, and it's the Page of Cups. What's the renewal? It's all about how they approach things here when it comes to love. So this person is basically figuring out they want to be, they want to come in here with the utmost highest here, okay? When they do come in and talk to you here, because it is, there is a renewal here, and they, it's like they are trying to approach this situation with a different tactic here, okay? When it comes to offering you love. So what's this new tactic here? Show me the new approach here. Show me this new approach here, this new tactic. They want to give the full cup this time. That's what's coming in. They want to give you the full cup. They don't want to just be a little page. They want to give you all of it. This is what's coming through. So this is what they've been thinking about. So if they're quiet right now and there's been little to no communication or just little communication because it's this person trying to figure out how they're going to offer you the full cup of love. Okay? This is what's coming through. That's a beautiful energy, okay? Wow. Wow. That's a beautiful... Uh, it's a great headspace they're in with the Two of Swords here on this approach. So I get it, okay? So uh, this is what they've been thinking this whole time. They've got to approach the situation differently. Three of Swords. Let's go to the Three of Swords. What's going on here? All right. So, i got to get my protection stone out again. So, they're really, their psyche here, it's like either a new cycle here. They're afraid here of what might come out of this cycle. And they're in their head. It's just like they're in their thoughts uh, really about this new cycle or completion of a cycle here. What else are they up in their head about here with these three swords? <laughs> three swords to the world. Let's go. Three swords to the world. Let's go. Three swords. And here's one sword coming on in. I gotta be real strategic with my card laying. <laughs> okay, so it's the Ace of Swords. It's truth. It's clarity here. What's this ace of swords down here on the table? We got one, two, three swords now, babies. Yeah. Whatever this person is getting ready to tell you here, they've got a lot of anxiety here and a lot of fear. What are they getting ready to tell Pisces here that they're so anxious about? That they've had a tower moment. And what's this tower moment entail? Mmm. had a tower moment here about how to capture your attention here so it's like this person really is trying to get your attention 
They are really... They're really trying to get your attention here. It's like they're ringing a bell here. Like, I feel like they're ringing a bell. They're like, Pisces, I want something to start up here again. I'm trying to get your attention. It's not working. And it's not working because they know that their approach here has is it's not enough. They need to give the full cup here. Not just a little dabble, not just a little trickle here, not turn on the faucet like your kitty cat so you can get the trickle drinks out of the, the, the faucet here. They need you to get, they need to turn the full faucet of love on and let that water fully flow out so that you can get a goddamn good drink like you're out in the desert here and you're thirsty as shit, okay? So they need to give you a full drink here. Okay, I give Pisces the full drink, let's go. Let's go with the Emperor here. So why is this Emperor showing up here? Why is the Emperor? Because, boom, the Emperor here, they want a shot here with you. This person here, this is a start of a new cycle here is what's coming through here. Start of something new. They're coming in. They're going to give you the full cup of love because their tactics here haven't been working here when it comes to getting your attention to start something up here with them so okay one card for or one card for each and we're going to do the final messages what else do you want to tell pisces huh, that was pretty uh yeah nine wands this person wants to open their little ball of emotion and show you some emotion this person could be spying on you and this person has had, uh, they've seen the light here at the end of the tunnel. Okay, Pisces? So, Carol's been a journey. You know what to do.